Hello everybody, Mr. here, and welcome back to Subnautica. On the last episode, we basically became a lot faster in everything we've done. We have our... what is that? Oh, that's just one of those toxic butts. We're gonna go to the Life Pod 17 eventually, but we're gonna go explore the Aurora. And maybe get started on a base building? Possibly? I don't know, but maybe, just, the Aurora may take up all our time. Oh, I'm gonna have to set my timer I'll get almost. I always forget this, you know? It's like... It's, it's a necessary thing I need to have, but I keep on forgetting it always. It's like... Why? Why do I have a timer if I forget to set it? Then again, I would be talking all day to you guys, and that'd be a little bit too much for my voice. So this episode, we're going to focus on the rescuing them, prefer hopefully, and also, uh, well, you're going to have a mating dance over here, apparently. Uh, you, I'll leave you two to it. Anyways, uh, we're going to the Aurora to see if we can do on here. Uh, we found the, the last, the other life pod in the Reese here. There's a whole bunch of you guys here. In the Reese, and there's no survivors, sadly. Team, I'd hit it on these guys' bad side. Like, jeez, they're mega huge. We're also looking for more pieces. I think I see you down here, a little box. We need to get more uh, a mobile vehicle frame, a, la a laser cutter, hopefully. Nope, I don't need that. We really need to get a laser cutter. If any of you know where to find this, that'd be helpful. If you guys spot it, just leave a comment down below in the comments. That would be helpful. But back up to the here we go. Okay. Oh, oh we're, we're gonna run out of power. Whew. Uh hmm. We may have to make a power saw. Or a battery for this. Or else we might not be doing too hot. Oh, there's a whole bunch of these. Oh, there's a whole bunch of you here. Don't like that. Have I explored this area yet? No, I have not. There's some uh, thank you. Thank you, Susan. Ahead of time, we'll help Propulsion cannon. And oh, cool. oh, shit. Damn. Things don't like me going near their freaking nests or whatever that is. It doesn't look like there's much else here. There's really pretty other fragments that might be of interest to us. No, I don't think I see anything else. This area is like completely devoid of life. There's like nothing here for us to use. So we're not gonna be making a base near the war, we're gonna be making a base further out. Wait, did I see something over here? Oh, I thought I saw something. Oh, it's another life pod. Let's go look what it is. I think I don't think we were able to get to this one because of the radiation, but let's see what we have here. There's also some kind of forest behind the reactor over here. Or the the, the dry the Aurora. Uh, Another one of these, a creature decoy, first aid kit I could use this right now. Oh, I could also use the water. We've got a creature decoy. That'll help us, I guess, be more avoidant of creatures. Okay, uh, let's see what we got here. Uh, where do we go? Life Pod 6 crew log number 2. Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a number 1? Oh, oh uh, yes, another did fine. It must be bad that they're, they're, I'll go back down there to check to see if that's still there. Here's life pod crew. the Altera crew. Landed in area of significant alien activity. Encountered predators in the Leviathan class, highly aggressive. Spectroscope scanner assigned species designator, Reaper. One specimen attempted to swallow the life Holy pod. God! Extensive damage in the process. Only viable option is to make for the safety of the Aurora crash site. Oh, uh, you're gone. I've retrieved sorry. a data box with the creature decoy and enough resources to fabricate a couple of them. The swim's longer than the decoy lifetime, but it should just be enough to keep them busy. If you don't find me on board the ship, presume I miscalculated. Uh, well, that's a shame. I'm so I salute you for swimming out, and I hope I don't encounter these side creatures. I really don't want to. But we'll check back and uh, see if we get the number one for the life pod six. Probably outside the base somewhere or something like that. A little life pod to get on top. Please don't be a big freaking creature here. I don't want to go deal with you. I already have these little ones to deal with. Like how big, like, those reef backs back there were really big, strong looking, big and giant. Please don't come out. Please don't come out. That's the one thing I fear, like, somebody coming out of the freaking Last darkness. In this region oh, you're telling me. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Oh, we better get to work then. I still have enough battery power to get. Oh, 
That is definitely not good for my health. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get out of here. Shoot. Uh, I don't think I can get through here. I'm gonna scan the dust though. Oh, yeah. Don't think I can get through. Is there any laser cutters? Like, I don't think I can get through this unless I get that propulsion cannon. I'm probably gonna need that. See how I can get this floodlight here as well. Uh, I don't see anything else. I'm gonna keep my knife out just in case I need to use it. That's a knife. There we go. That's a knife. We're gonna get up. That'll be a problem we'll have to figure out. Oh, we're so low on. Uh, please don't collapse on me. I was hoping to find a laser cutter fragment here, but it may not look like. I mean, it looks like we're not going to be able to find one here. Oh, uh, uh, I'm getting in the water! Creatures. Nasty little spiders. The first aid kit now. We're getting a lot of supplies on the ship. Another battery. Uh, I don't there's anything else around here, really. That's just a thing. Uh, Caution. Scans show the digestive tracts of nearby life force contain human tissues. Oh, that's very. It's been trying to bite me, so I. Holy figure. Oh, just don't fall on my head. That'd be a bad thing for my health. So we're gonna need the fire extinguisher. Oh, we have, or we have like, I don't want to as well. I think I should have, I think I have a little bit more of my inventory as well. Let's go ahead and replace the sea glide I'm going to be using up here. Now let's get that all done. It's a really good mechanic they have, like here, I have to like, you can need to unlock stuff to get further in the game. I hope I can find a laser cutter fragment here somewhere. This is where the life pods were apparently. Doesn't look like there's much left. Oh, I need this. Aurora systems are running on local, local? power. Unable to remotely download. Okay, this should help us data. get in the places I guess I can't move. The objects I can't move. New blueprint acquired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, installations, floodlight, scanner room. Integrating new PDA Radiation. data. Propulsion canna. Yeah. Uh Aurora Engineering Room, here we go. Exiting. Sleep mode. Loading voice recognition. Engineer Barkley and Chief Technology Officer you identified. Drone, get me a propulsion cannon. <laughs> repulsion cannon retrieved. Hey, Berkeley, install that circuit box with that repulsion cannon and you'll punch a hole in the cargo bay. Damn it, drone, I said propulsion, not repulsion. <laughs> Recalibrate sensors. Sensors recalibrated. Sensors aren't the problem. I tweak the program. It's like you now. It doesn't like being told what to do. <sighs> Sounds like they're having a great relationship. His name's Albert now. Albert, I know <laughs> it's not your fault, but it would really help me do my job if you'd bring me what I asked for. Thanks for your time. <laughs> they're having a nice... Thank you. Now go away. Entering hibernation mode. Boss, this hobby of yours isn't making my job any easier. Or safer. Maybe so, but it's all that's stopping me from being so bored. I take a space walk in my skivvies. <laughs> oh yeah, they're they had a great relationship there apparently. Uh no just a self. Let's see what we got here. Integrating new PDA data. So here we are, finally in open space. We cross the galaxy to install a phase gate. To, we crossed the galaxy to install a phase gate to send ships to mine resources to build more expensive ships to install fancier phase gates. Are we trying to exhaust the galaxy or just ourselves? Uh, Yui's birthday, 8, 1.806, 40 weeks before we get home, 400 weeks, it feels like we, before we get home. Not enough credits, Altera is paying me. Oh, I feel so. 1454 is the cargo bay code. Okay, I don't get stuck. Ah.
Altera launches the Aurora. New PDA data. Phase gate announced for the Ariadne arm. Uh, Altera launches the Aurora. The furthest reaches of inhabited space are due to expand as Altera Corp launches a newly constructed capital ship carrying a phase gate bound for the Ariadne arm. The Aurora will travel from a space talk on the edge of Altera space, making hundreds of consecutive phase gate jumps through nine different transgub authorities and arrive on the far side of the Ariadne arm in three months' time. From there, the command crew will pilot the ship beyond the final phase gate, arriving in the next solar system approximately 18 months later. So it seems like the, they're traveling through uh, phase gates. Uh, there are the, there are the elite team of engineers will begin a six-month construction project on the new phase gate, a multi-trillion credit investment. In the absence of existing infrastructure in the region, the vessel is equipped with advanced thermal and nuclear power facilities. No kidding. Altera Corp currently operates 9% of all phase gates in the galaxy. If the Aurora's mission is successful, Altera will have outmaneuvered a cabal of Mongolian corporations operating a range of outposts and mines in the region. Ooh, the Mongols are doing pretty well. Yeah, okay, uh, I don't think there's anything else to have here. here. Let's go through. Let's go over this way. That was administration. We're going to cargo now. So it's self scan anyway, that's what we have. Self scan complete. Foreign bacteria count has reached statistically significant yeah. levels. No adverse effects detected. Be vigilant for symptoms. Okay. You do you. Currently infected with some kind of disease. That's nothing concerning at all, Susan. There we go, we're getting through. We can get back up too, apparently. We can get up through there. Okay. So we're heading down into Cargo Bay. Four, five, six, four. Four, five, six, four. No. Uh-huh, you're saying that. Wait, 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 you're saying we got shot down? Is that what you're saying? No, no, no offensive. Like, that's what I assume. One, four, five, four. Four, five, four. Wait, so... We got shot down from what I'm gathering from that. Oh god, we're not doing too hot here. Should have grabbed that other uh I don't think there's anything over here. Yeah, there may be. Nope, there's nothing over here. Oh we're running out of fuel. Cyclops engine fragment. Submarine! Oh my god, we need that. We need our submarine. We need that. That's, that's our next goal. If we ever get to it. But we have to have to those people as well, so... We'll get to it eventually, probably. We'll get a base. We gotta get a base established. That's our next... Probably getting a base would be very helpful for our endeavors. Uh, I don't see anything else. Just another fragment. We got the Cyclops engine blueprints. Transgov Profile Altera Corporation. That's some water. Integrating new PDA data. Oh, we should be fine. We got a lot of batteries. Uh, I don't see anything in there. Nothing in there. Let's see what we got here for the next thing. Transgov Profile Altera Corporation. One of the largest suppliers of spacefaring technologies and consumer electronics in the Federation. The official supplier of the Trans TSA. Consistently ranked amongst the galaxy's best employers, uh-huh. Began life as a defense manufacturer in the mid-22nd century. National motto, get what you deserve. Yeah, uh-huh. Although most transgovs can trace the route back to Earth, Altera literally means by Earth. is the only one brave enough to take its name. During the expansion, Altera supplied arms to all sides, acquiring and housing a vast colonist workforce and making the transition from manufactured to corporate state. Altera's threats to cease trade was one of the turning points in the conflict, bringing about the end of hostilities and the signing of the Charter. Free enterprise within Altera's base is encouraged, but competition is tight and all goods exported off-world must be Altera branded. Profitable businesses are brought out by the state, are bought out by the state, owners ascending to the board of directors. Well-known Altera technologies like Cyclops and Merciful originated with such private enterprises. 
Despite superficial similarities to national governments, the corporation's lawyers have always maintained that it has no legal obligation to its em What the hell? My God. But voluntarily elects to take on the roles usually served by a democratically elected government. This claim has not yet been tested in Federation courts. This sounds like a crap company to work for. I mean, if, uh, the employees here are commenting the right. Jeez, dude. Sound like a good company to work for. 100% at all. Uh, I don't see anything down that way we need to get. Oh, more, more goodies! Oh, thank you. I was, I was starving. Good to my nutrients. Really needed this. Haha, uh -huh, yeah. Uh, Seamoth Bay. That's something we do need. Do we have a laser cutter in here? In the boxes? We also gotta contain a nuclear threat, so. Nothing here. Okay. Uh, there's nothing here. Uh, drive room, uh, let's go to Seamoth Bay. Let's be more important, because we need more vehicles. Really desperately need more vehicles. Ugh, oh, water, we're flooding! Our oceanic life is sources. What was that? I saw something. I saw something. A bleeder. Holy. Yeah. Oh, crap! Holy crap, that thing tried to eat my... Holy shit, these things are trying to eat me. Uh, I'll take that. What was that, even? Uh, Seamoth death module, okay, uh... Kind of trying to avoid these things. I think I already have Seamoth blueprint fragments. Oh no, I have, I have it now, thank you. Thank you very much, that's what I needed. Uh, I don't think there's anything else. Oh, there's something here. Uh, get out of here. Be careful. We're heading to the drive room now. A lot of the creatures around here are freaking carnivorous. The drive sustained internal damage during ah! Ah! fire! Qualifications. Oh, uh, I may not have the qualifications required for this, but I could try. Oh, what did I need here? I swear to God, I got something here. Operations logs. VR sweet log. Loading program. Desert Island drama. Three players. Normal. Player one has washed away by... Has been washed away by an unusually high tide. Player two has traded a coconut. Uh, has planted a coconut. Player's eating hungry. It looks like, it's just like a games log of some sort. Um... Damn, the guy got shot in the head while sleeping. It's like some kind of castaway drama crap game here. Okay, I don't have any more fuel up in my thing, so it's kind of a problem. I'll take that as well. Getting efficiency modules. I'll just repair it then, I guess. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Ten more? Okay. Looks like we're gonna be using up all our freaking repair juice. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Hey, you're the one who had me do this. What do you mean to do this? Because of that. The apparent devastation on our life forms that this could happen. Is that a crab that just fell from this? Training crabs or whatever that was. I have a message here too, apparently. Uh, nothing in this one. Looks like the rest of our things are gonna be underwater. Can't believe I also have a. Uh, I'm a really popular dude. I get all these stress messages. Containment breach repaired. Hopefully, we can find a lady. Oh yeah, repaired in my job. Bob the Builder. Here we go. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Okay, so six more. Getting the nuclear radiation under control would be very helpful for us, at least. Further breaches detected. The question is, can I? Oh, yeah, I can probably finish. I have like. Containment breach repaired. 
further breaches. Did All these little sparkies where I'm going to go repair. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Okay, so two more. I haven't seen the other two yet, so. Containment breach repaired. There it is. I see it now. Need one more. Thankfully, I got this like high capacity O2 tank. Can you stay active for a while? Wishing all my power on this. Let's get this under control, though. There we go. Are we fixed? Can we? F I don't think we can fix the Aurora to go back home. I, I don't think it's possible in this game. It's on the stadium. Radiation levels decreasing. I really don't think it's possible for the Aurora to be fixed again to where it was originally. Doesn't look like it's in that. Operative state. Is there anything down there? Was there? No, it wasn't. Okay. My giblets! Okay, okay, got through that. Uh, that's a good thing. Uh, one, it's a positive note. Prawn Bay and Locker Room. And you need a laser cutter, so we're gonna have to go find that. It's probably out there in the wild. What the hell is wrong with this one? This one's green. That's one with symptoms of infection. Integrating what? Data. I'm gonna get up here. Can I climb a ladder? Uh, problem here. If I can't get up. Oh, uh, I can't. Okay, there we go. What's what we have here? What was that? Infection. Where did this? Uh, close all of this up. Uh. Advanced theories. This worm is displaying signs of a bacterial and I'll glow green? Light green blisters around are forming networks around the infection sites. Pathology shows a waterborne bacteria capable of penetrating the body through the skin and respiratory system. Under uh, indications of genetic mutation and aggressive behavior, the bacteria itself is unlikely, unlike any so far recorded in human exploration. Warning, may be contagious. Avoid. Do not under any circumstances consume the flesh. Holy crap, I got it. Oh, that's definitely not good. That thing bit me too. Oh, uh, is there anything else in here that I can use? Uh, anything? Uh, I don't think there. Okay, there's nothing that way. There's nothing this way either. Uh, nothing else down here from the looks of it. Uh, let's replace it with our sea glide again. We'll pick up that other extinguisher on the way back to where Phil, I guess. Uh, get rid of this one. Keep the other one. Oh, oh, oh! So it's tripping on my own fire extinguisher. So we're gonna need to get the repair tool in order to get advanced further into the game itself, or else we're not gonna be able to get anywhere. There's also another area I think we can get into with the propulsion cannon. So we're also gonna need to work around those two as well. Uh, a little bit more time left. Uh, yeah, I'm up. Here we go. Oh. Okay, uh, I think we have a little bit more time left to exploring. Okay, uh. Let's do an epic dive off this, off the beautiful Aurora out here. The door's like, woo! Oh yeah, you do there. 10 out of 10 dive there. There's another. I swear to God, there was another one up there somewhere. Another area we get into. We just have to. Be, oh, right there, right there. I think it's right there. We have a propulsion cannon, though. Uh, we should start making our way through the other place as well. Maybe they have a laser cutter fragment we could use. I wouldn't know though. So. Da, 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 da. Or we could try looking for it around the kelp forest again. Let's got the. I think I got the last one there around there somewhere. Or that weird, strange forest. Oh, it's just these guys again. Thank you. I mean, they could check on me. I know you're concerned on my health and not totally wanting to eat me, but... What's this area? I don't know if I can take my radiation suit off yet because of the radiation. Hopefully it'll get under control, though. I'll be able to take off the suit eventually. But for right now, we're going to keep it on. Oh, it looks like we're running out of time as well. We spent a lot of time exploring the Aurora in that one reading. 
Let's we know more about what's going on in the game itself, though. That's very helpful. We'll start probably building a base probably very soon. Okay. Uh, let's get back to the base. We'll go over to the other one in the next, probably the next episode. We'll be able to go. We'll be able to go over to the Life Pod 17. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot about the other thing. He goes over here. Another life, Papas. Let's go get that real quick. Oh, I'm still here. Right there it is. If I goes out. This was life pod number six, right? I think it. There, yeah, I see that little blue thing in the bottom there. Passing one hundred meters. Yeah, yeah, Susan. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Anything? Oh, there was stuff out here. Ultra glide fence. I could use that. Is there anything? Else? Oh, yeah, there is. I see it. Got it. New and I'm out. Data. Uh, okay. Go back to the art. Beautiful. We'll listen to it on the way back. Okay. Ma'am, I need you to stay calm. We're not in immediate danger. Where are the rescue teams? The Aurora didn't make it. So, where are the rescue teams? They're dead, ma'am. We have rendezvous coordinates, but the routes are radiated. You do? So, okay. what are you going to do? I'm head of human resources, ma'am. This is <laughs> But the PDA says if we can find some lead, we can make radiation suits. Oh, there. I am not setting foot outside this life pod without the proper protection. Wow. Sorry. I'll go. She seems smart. Oh, I ran out of power. V. Okay, uh... Uh, next one. Oh, I'm gonna die. There we go. Gotta hold back to the batteries there. Oh, we're gonna have to change, uh, we're gonna have to stop the recording soon anyways here. But guys, this was an eventful episode, actually. We learned a lot more about- Oh, we also have another message to go through. This is Sunbeam. You know Aurora. We're from a little transgov on the far side of Andromeda, and we have a saying there. Yeah? There's no bad without the good. No good without the bad. Yeah. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former, but that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Well, you're very positive. Thank you, Mr. Quinn. We're scanning for somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. Oh, thank you. So oh, Sunbeam looks like the next episode we'll be able to get the Sunbeam here as well. Uh, let's put some stuff in our inventory. Uh, I don't need this right now. Yeah, or this. Or this. A bunch of like stuff in our inventory we don't need. Uh, we need some... uh anyways, uh, let's go find back up. Anyways, guys, this is the end of the episode. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed us exploring the majestic Aurora. And anyways, guys, you have a nice, you guys have a nice night or whatever you are, morning or wherever. And I'll see you guys next episode. See ya.